All right. So we're asked to sketch the graph of f of x is equal to 1.5 by x minus 4 squared plus 3. Now, this equation is quadratic, and it's in what's called the vertex form. If we have an equation of the form f of x is equal to a times x minus h squared plus k, this is called the vertex form, and the vertex is the ordered pair h, k. And the a tells us a lot also. If a is positive, it opens up. And if a is negative, it opens down. The parabola, that is. So, first question you always ask yourself when you want to sketch the graph of a quadratic function is does it open up or down? Well, this one, so open up or down. Well, this one's going to open up because A is positive. Second question we're going to ask ourselves is, what's the vertex? Since the equation, uh, the function is in the that vertex form, x minus 4 squared plus 3, the vertex is 4, 3. Now, a third thing we would like to find is the y-intercept, now, the, or the vertical intercept. And so recall to find a vertical intercept, you let the x value equal 0. So let's find the y, uh, the vertical intercept. Letting x take the value 0, f of 0 would equal 1.5 by 0 minus 4 squared plus 3. Order of operations. 1.5 by negative 4 squared plus 3. Negative 4 squared is 16. 1.5 by 16 plus 3. 1.5 times 16 is 24. So I have 24 plus 3, which is 27. So then the vertical intercept is 0, 27. So 4, 3 is the vertex. Now, since it opens up, the vertex is the minimum point. All right, so I know everything else is above that point. I have 0, 27. Now, every parabola has what's called an axis of symmetry that goes through the vertex. So if I draw this vertical line through the axis of symmetry, uh, through the vertex, that's the axis of symmetry. And what we mean by that is there's a mirror image of every point on the other side of that line. So this point is four units away from the axis of symmetry. If I go four units on the other side, there's another point on the curve. So this point is 827. Now, if helpful, it's always a good idea to find maybe one other point and its symmetric point to help you draw the curve. So I'm going to draw one more. I'm going to find one more point. I'm just going to pick a value. Uh, how about 2 for x? f of 2 would be 1, 1.5 by 2 minus 4 squared plus 3. So that would be 1.5 by negative 2 squared is 4 plus 3. That's 6 plus 3, which is 9. So that would give me 2, 9. Plotting the point 2, 9. And its symmetric point, 6, 9. That helps me fill it in a little bit more, and so I can draw, get a rough sketch of this curve here. And so it's going to look something like this.